Hello, sweet team. Welcome to our pizza finale. Yay! It is finally here. So I sure hope you've prepped your ingredients because after watching this, all you will want is some good old homemade pizza. Let's get started. So I start by making my dough and setting it aside to rise while I go ahead and prep my other ingredients. Now I have an in-depth version of my pizza dough recipe already on my channel. I will leave a link for that below. So do check it out. All right, y'all. So um, I'm making two regular size pizzas. Now the original recipe will make you two thin crust um, pizza dough recipes. Now, because I want to show you a regular pizza, I've added one cup to the recipe of flour, one more tablespoon to the recipe of olive oil, and two more tablespoons of water to the original recipe. Everything else stays the same. All right, so check out that recipe. I have now oiled a bowl, well two bowls because I'm making two pizzas and I'll allow it to rise outside because it's nice and hot and this makes your life easy rather than deflating your dough after it's risen together. Okay, then I prep my ingredients which I'll be using sausage, peppers and onions as one topping and the other topping will just be cheese because my kids like plain cheese pizza and so I dice everything up and with the onions once you cut it up be sure to separate them so they're not sticking together and I'll be using beef sausage you can use whatever type of protein that you like that is why it's pizza you could put whatever you want on it okay <laughs> all right so this prep is done so I'll go ahead and grate some of our cheese and set that aside once everything is done, we are ready to set up. I have a 14 inch uh, pizza crisper. Our dough is nice and ready. Let's begin. So all I do is to turn my dough over onto my tray and spread it out with my hands. Now you can use a rolling pin at this point, but I like to play in my dough, working it until it reaches the edges and then we are set then I do the same with the other tray and then we will begin to layer it up with our toppings yes pizza do it ready are you guys ready why are ready Anna because this pizza is about to go down so I only like to use about two tablespoons of marinara sauce but it depends on how large your pizza is I feel too much sauce on your pizza ruins it okay so yes I don't care how good your sauce tastes if you overwhelm your pizza mm -mm, it won't. <laughs> so then I layer it up with my cheese my sausages my peppers my onions set it aside and layer it for my babies then we're going to bake it in a 340 degree oven for about 20 minutes or until our crust is nice and golden and our cheese have melted nicely and our topping is nice and cooked so there we go they are ready and check out the crust is it perfection or what <laughs> Yes, y'all, the pizza's ready. It's looking good. Oh my goodness. We're just going to go ahead and cut them up, serve them, and enjoy. But you all are invited. I cannot be stingy. Just look at this. Perfectly ready. The crust is not crunchy at all. It is just perfect crunch on the outside, nice and moist on the inside. Look at it. Is it beautiful? I think so make sure you make your own but until then make your way to my house I'm waiting for you and sweet team come on everybody is invited thank you all so so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video if you're a new subscriber 
welcome to my channel this is sweet ajele thank you so much for subscribing and to the sweet team i love you all so so much until i see you in my next video stay safe keep loving each other and remember that the love of family is life's greatest blessing bye all